What's up everybody, I'm Epic Garcias. Today I'm going to be talking about the, the worst, one of the worst updates Roblox has done in a while, you know? I mean like, it's it's just so insane how terrible Roblox can be. Like, they're, they're just making this game worse and worse and worse every single, every single year they're doing something to make it worse, right? And honestly, I've been witnessing it, I've been seeing it, I haven't done anything about it. I just sat there watching it. I could just quit, you know, but there's still some, at least some decent games, and I kind of like the game still, so I'd like to stay for a while longer. Not Maybe till the end, who knows. But yeah, so I'm kind of going to do some sort of a series where I talk about all of the bad Roblox updates. There are so many of them. There is so many of them that it will take a long time to put them all in one video, so I'm going to do separate videos not too long it's gonna be just a couple minutes just me summarizing and giving you the facts about how bad these updates really are so today i'm going to be talking about the most recent terrible endeavor roblox has made which is this new design so they say with the new avatar editor we are launching in the next few weeks you'll only be able to select one color at a time to re represent all body parts going forward we highly encourage users to save outfits with unique body parts, colors right now, if they wish to go back to them in the future. Okay, so as you can see, it, it's already bad. Like this two sentences already tell you how bad this update is. Okay, let's go to their blog. This is where they so on so try to tell us or explain to us why they're even doing this. They explain quote unquote. That's what I meant. Why is he okay? Anyways, let's see. So here is the avatar editor update. So, I'm just going to kind of read through here. So, they're just talking about their f smartphones, right? You know what I hate? I the, the thing I hate the most is staff ignorance towards other players. Like, they don't even listen to anybody. I could go on. I, I want to explain that a lot in another video. But for now, let's just continue on this. So, we're just bringing this intuitive experience. Yeah, yeah, blah, blah, blah. Okay. So, as you can see here, this is what they want to go for, instead of this, right? They, they want to go for this. Now, to be fair, it doesn't look that bad. I'm telling you, like, like the, the layout here looks nice. It, it actually looks pretty decent. And it would look like a, it, it seems like a good update. The only problem is that they're removing this. Why would you have to remove this to put it on here? Like, do they have no... They can't, they can't script it or something? They're too lazy to script that? They just want to remove it entirely? Like, they don't even tell us here. So they say, We've redesigned the architecture of the customization menu on the website so it has a more consistent visual language. It's better organized, allow you to seamlessly browse and swap between different categories. Yeah, now that's okay. But when they say more consistent visual language, I don't really see visual language in selecting one color at a time. What kind of language is that? <laughs> it's just like, it's like if everyone just spoke like five different languages. English, maybe, French, Chinese, Mandarin, I don't know. No no dialects, nothing. You're just, That's basically what it is. They, they, they're going against their own update here by saying consistent visual language. Like as if... As if you have multiple languages to work with anyways, they're gonna give you like a preset color that you gotta use on your entire thing. It's like, you gotta speak, it's like for languages, you gotta speak one language, you can't speak multiple, you gotta speak one. And that, that's a, that's an absolute retarded update by Roblox though. So their goal is to make a better experience on the avatar editor. Well, they're not really doing that, if they're gonna <laughs> do that, change the body colors to skin tones. Why the heck would you want skin tones instead? Like, that. Okay, so they say for the first time on the website, we're also going to introduce a more refined skin tone, right? Than our current body color palette. So I mean, like, why? Why would you want a skin tone instead of a body color? It's the same thing. It's just that you get to pick around multiple body parts. That's what makes this fun. Even is customizing your character. Now, you, if you're just gonna remove a feature, that's so so like it's it there's nothing wrong with it but they decide to remove it anyways and this is the colors that they're gonna give you this really that that's what you're gonna give me and and it's got to be all over your character that's terrible so see like what the heck why would you even want to do that 
Yeah, and then they tell us that, oh, you gotta, you gotta save all your outfits and all that stuff. Okay, and then the last sentence, as we continue to expand our mo modernized, it's not really mo it, it's not really modern to be honest. <laughs> if you're gonna remove just changing basic color, like basic colors of your joints, I don't think that's pretty modern. We look forward to hearing your feedback. Oh, you, I'll bet. Help us further improve the experience. Come chat with us, blah, blah, blah. Okay. So yeah, so you can see how bad this update is already. It's terrible. Just awfully terrible. Like, what's wrong with just doing this? Why can't I do this anymore? Like, why can't I just do this? What's wrong with this? Anyways, yeah. So what I recommend you guys doing is if you have any cool color comms that combinations that you like, save them into your outfits like I'm doing here. I'm saving a bunch of hackers. I don't know why. I'm saving all the colors I've made, color comms I made. Because you're not allowed to do this anymore. You can't look like a default unless you actually change yourself into a default. So I gotta do like a bunch of them. So yeah, that's gonna be it. I hope you guys enjoy this. And you know, if you don't agree with Roblox, you can't do anything about it. Just to be honest, you can't do anything. They're not gonna change it. Trust me, they're gonna go through with this. They're gonna remove it and it will stay removed forever. Just like almost every single other bad update. It's forever. Okay? So that's going to be it. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out.